hi guys hi welcome back whole day has passed it's already like about to be 3 30 i've just been doing nothing all day i just haven't been like motivated I'm trying to find ways to motivate myself but i know motivation in times where you're not motivated you have to be self-disciplined and getting myself to discipline myself to do the things i need to get done is not it lately i feel like but you know what i do like I like how when I vlog, I'm more motivated to do things. Like, it makes me want to get out of my comfort zone and, I don't know, like, get stuff done. Because I got to be productive for the vlog. Like, you're not going to just be watching me here and I'm doing nothing. Like, you, you don't want some, some me doing something. So, that's some plans later today. I have a debut I need to go to. And... I'm excited for that because it's my friend's to boot. Yeah. get herself together but i'm on my way to the dubu i'm literally so like i'm scared that i'm gonna be late because i don't want to be late but i don't want to be too early you know what i mean the bangs i don't know if they're baying <laughs> do you guys want to be you know the baying the, 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 the talk sound like i don't know if my ba bangs are ba you know what i mean CRM, you make this work. Oh, I still say it wrong. Oh, this is 
actually so sparkly. Oh my God. I that's exactly what I said. Everybody do so Literally. Like, I want to like. Oh my God. <laughs> wait, wait, talk again, talk again. Hold on. Oh my God. <laughs> The vlog. Hi guys. <laughs> <laughs> this is a Hey guys. I didn't make them. Wait, I feel like this is like. Like, have you seen the judges of the food review? Yeah. But, uh, okay, so this me. We're professional. 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 A foodie? 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 A What's so funny? Did we go to Santa Fe here? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. When I first met Kayla, it was in our AP English Lang class. But as I continued to talk with her, I learned that she was not only beautiful, but also extremely intelligent, very well-spoken, and extremely kind-hearted. The biggest advice that I would ever give you is something that my parents have always told me. Usted sufre porque usted quiere, which means you suffer because you want to. It may be a little harsh, but the way that I've always interpreted it, and the way that I hope you interpret it as well, is that even though you may be struggling, may be facing discrimination, may be facing a hardship in life, there will always be something optimistic to look forward to and that you should always focus on that optimism instead of focusing on the negative. Hi, um, my name is Camilla. Um, I met Kayla last year and there's a lot to say about you. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> words can't express my appreciation for you, but I thought doing it this way can sum it up a bit. <laughs> Kayla. C is for capable. Seeing just how capable you are of putting your all into learning. And this capability trait you hold goes beyond academics. A is for admirable. I admire you a lot. <laughs> I remember when I first met you in speech and debate and Mr. Simmons introduced me to you and said that you wanted to try out congressional debate. I was so excited. Watching you give your speeches and hear your voice every time you speak makes me so thankful to have met such an amazing person. I is for inspiring. You inspired me so much throughout speech and debate. Watching you become more and more confident with every tournament motivated me to try my best with you. And I'll always miss our memories when we'd go to, cap to the cafe together and we would work on our speeches. <laughs> Living in the moment with you just gives me so much happiness. L is for loving. Just the type of person you are and your personality is the best kind. A is for artistic. Whenever I see your artwork, I'm just amazed all over again. H is for heartwarming. That's what you are, Kayla. C-A-I-L-A-H stands for Kayla. You're Kayla. You can do anything your mind can think of. Honestly, the letters of your name doesn't prove it itself, but you're really an amazing person.
you look so crazy. <laughs> right now I'm getting my ballet. My ballet ticket because I was not trying to walk to my car by myself. My favorite kind is the cookies and cream. But I just got back from the Dubu. It was really fun. It was fun. I'm glad to see my friend Kayla and Camilla. And see like the friends I haven't seen in a minute. It's sad to see her go off, but I know like she has to. Like she's gonna achieve amazing things, you know? But now I'm just gonna get uh I wanted to take a shower, but it's like 12 a.m. And I don't know, something about midnight showers that aren't the vibe for me right now because i get paranoid but i'm gonna like clean myself up a little bit and go to sleep It is Sunday. Today, I'm just gonna go to the movies with my dad, and that's about it. Um, I really didn't do much today. I'm about to do my hygiene and everything and get ready for the movie. <laughs> lately that not even lately like in general i just like when i'm having a conversation with someone and they're going through an issue i'll just give them advice without even asking like advice bombing or something and i'm trying to work on that because like you can't like have a conversation with someone and then like give them advice if they didn't ask for it because sometimes people just need to experience it and think it through but like somewhere in my brain it's like you should give them this piece of advice this piece of information might help them when in reality like at the end of the day, they'll learn on their own terms. Because I feel like I have such useful information that helped me. But then again, that's just what helped me. It could not help them, you know, at the end of the day. But I'm working on it. It's just, it's hard because I feel like I want to help them. I don't want them to go through the same stuff I went through. And I want them to, you know, just grow and evolve. But it does come off narcissistic. Or like, not narcissistic, but like egotistical end of the day i wanted to come off as i care about you and i hear you but sometimes it doesn't do it so i guess i just have to be like mm -hmm, yeah but at the same time that's what i would want someone to do to me but then again you can't live like that mentality you can't have the mentality well i would want someone to do this for me so i'm going to do it for them like at the end of the day everyone's different this little event Day. it's giving family friendly but the thing is i can't like this skirt is so long that if i don't tuck it into something that it'll fall so 
I either have to get it hemmed or just deal with it. And right now I'm just doing it. <laughs> listening to music and doing nothing i love i love doing that listening like especially if it's like new music i'm just listening to new music and i'm just staring into the abyss or in nature in this case i feel like that is such a vibe don't mind these acne patches but your girl she's going through it <laughs> but the movie the movie was cute um Honestly, I feel like there's a lot of dirty jokes there. And for it being like a kid's movie, I was like, girl, this is not incognito. Like, they were straight up like dirty jokes. Honestly, it was like a movie about love. And I was just like, wow. So cute. <laughs> Even though I, 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 you know, everyone wants to be in love. It's just, I wish our media wouldn't hyper romanticize it so much and just make it so like you have to be in love or you'll find love da 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 type beat I'm gonna stay here probably listen to music mess around for like 30 minutes before the sun sets mm -hmm. 